Hi guys, welcome to Cinnamon and Honey Reborn Nursery. We have sweet little Olivia here. She is my one and only little silicone baby. And today we are going to, she's all bundled up for winter and we'll put this on her when we go outside, but we are going to put this adorable little dress on her. It's um, it is by Friednik Creations and it is newborn. Um, it does have a little bonnet to go with. I don't know if you can see very well in the camera, but it has some little white threading here. And then it has these super cute little delicate white threading here. And then a little bit on the collar, some little details and it does look long it kind of looks like a christening gown but i wanted to share this with you guys so you can be the first one to see me put it on her and by the way while i'm getting this um little nightgown unbuttoned um if you haven't subscribed to our channel i highly recommend it go ahead and hit that subscribe button you know you want to you can see all of our beautiful little dolls that we create. Hit that subscribe button, hit the like, share it with your friends. Uh, we just have a lot of fun here. And if you're new to the channel, um, Honey, I'm Cinnamon, and Honey is my little Shih Tzu. And she is hypoallergenic and she does not shed, so no worries as far as her getting any hair on the babies i really have her bundled up here guys i have her in this little snowsuit type of deal it did snow a few days ago in my town so just about six inches but um i wanted her to be warm and uh let's get she's got so many clothes on oh yes she is pretty and pink she has this little sleeper with an owl on it so cute okay we're gonna take this off and then we're gonna put this precious precious little gown on her whoops <laughs> come here whoopsie as you guys know with silicone they're very floppy um tricky to dress but they're the cutest oh cutest little bugs on the planet <laughs> let me get her situated a little better here oh she has echo plex 20 so she is really really floppy gotta hold her head okay i'm wondering if i leave this on her will it show through here let's see mm. well, let's go ahead and take it off of her and be very careful look at that cute little belly look at that little belly button so cute that arm through there but yeah guys what's your while well, you join me for this outfit change let's talk what's your favorite reborn baby are you a fan of the silicone babies or do you prefer the vinyl uh, do you like cuddle babies what is your favorite I think vinyl I think silicone is my favorite and then just because look at this look at this girl and then obviously silicone is super expensive so you know i can't have too many silicones in my nursery but eventually i hope to get a boy but do you prefer the silicone babies or do you prefer vinyl babies cuddle babies 
or even the full vinyl babies that don't have the cloth body. I love the silicone. And then, like I said, my second favorite is vinyl. Um, vinyl is a lot easier to dress, a lot easier to take care of. Um, as you know, um, silicone babies, their hair is rooted, but there's no way to seal it from the inside since she's one solid piece. So um, you have to be really careful with her hair. You have to be more careful with her limbs and just have to, whoops, <laughs> just have to be more careful dressing her, more careful handling her. Definitely not for kids. I saw somebody posted on my Facebook group looking for a silicone baby for my two-year-old. I was like, uh, nope, because I'm 50 something and can't even, I still have trouble like dressing this baby properly. So, um, I do not recommend these for small children. They are not toys. They are works of art. And, um, even I wouldn't even recommend a vinyl um, reborn baby for that age of child. I would, in my opinion, I would wait until my child got uh, um, old enough to be responsible and know how to hold a baby, maybe somewhere from like 13 to 15, possibly. Okay, y'all, first of all, Second of all, I got these nails for my birthday, as I showed you before, and it is making it very hard to button all these little buttons. Oh, geez. Oh, am I going to be able to do this or not? Let's see. I just have to use the tips of my fingers, but I hardly ever have nails. It's just I thought it was my birthday and... I'll get some pretty nails for the celebration and they've been a lot of fun. It's just nails and reborns don't go together very well <laughs> or nails and uh, babies for that matter. Nails and any kind of baby. But let's see here. Oh goodness. These little buttons are so tiny. So teeny tiny. Gotta get it like right in the hole. All right, you guys are seeing some bloopers right now. If you've watched this far, thank you. Because, yeah, this is not a very good, not a very good look for me trying to do these buttons. But I'm actually getting them quite faster than I thought I would have. These nails will be coming off in like another month or so. So, be a little bit easier. I hate when you almost get it in there and then it slips back out. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry, guys. Okay. I got it. Okay. I hope the little bonnet fits her. Um, so cute. Okay, I give up. But you get the idea. I will have my um, husband to help me button her up when he gets back. <laughs> he doesn't have the nails that I have. Okay, let's get her, this thing pulled down. Oh, it's long. Mm. Okay, let's see here. Oh, this is the cutest pink color. So cute. And I, I find that these sizes do run a little bigger um, when they come from other countries, uh, like France or European sizes for babies, I feel like they come a little bit bigger than normal. This is newborn. I was advised to get preemie, but didn't trust it. So <laughs> here we are with this cute little dress on her. Oh, look at that. Let's take her little hair. She has the cutest little blonde hair and we'll just brush that down gently. You want to be really gently, like I said, about the hair. And then, okay. 
Wow, if you guys watch this long, this disaster, good for you. <laughs> I really didn't think this was going to be that difficult to do. But look at the results. Oh, look at this little baby. I will clip her little thing on here for Olivia. It fits her. I think this is how it's supposed to fit. It's supposed to be long, so. Oh, <clears throat> there we go. <laughs> what do you guys think? Say, what do you think? What do you think of my new little dress? So cute. Let's see if she wants her little pacifier. We'll just squeeze her cheeks a little bit and kind of wiggle it in there. Sometimes I'll use a little baby powder or a little something to get it in there. But there she is. Isn't she precious? <laughs> oh, let me see. I want to hold her. Oh. <clears throat> She's a big girl. She weighs about almost eight pounds and she is just precious she's just precious mm. so cute okay okay what do you guys think <laughs> she's so cute she's so cute <laughs> all right well thank you for joining us for this beautiful unique outfit change and um, stay tuned for more uh, new babies that we have and more fun with Olivia. And I hope you guys have a great day. We will see you later. Little Olivia is going to go take a little nappy. Let's go. Bye-bye. <laughs>